So Cobalt sent us a box of tools with no restrictions, no guidelines. Told us we could do whatever we wanted to with them. So we're gonna open them up, check them out together and see what we can come up with. Let's just dive right into it. This box of tools that came yesterday from Cobalt. I personally have never heard of them. So Frankie and I are gonna bust the, bust that box open and see what's in there and uh, try everything out. Half inch high torque impact. Looks like you got flashlight size all. And impacts. The little hammer drill it looks like. Battery one. Hopefully there's a bunch of batteries. That would be hilarious if they only sent one battery. Looks like it so far. Oh dang. There's the impact. I got the... Nice little impact looks like though. Oh yeah. 24 volt. I got the uh, little hammer drill here. 20 volt. It's got a, I don't know, they feel, they got a nice grip yeah, to them. Yeah, they did, yeah. that one does too, yeah, the flashlight. That's kind of slick. One battery so far. One battery so far. You want to pop that out of I'm curious to try that. We got two batteries. Two, where? Oh. Two batteries. No, there's the charger, okay. The charger. I'm gonna jump in here because I wanna just kind of break something down for you. When it comes to batteries, they're all basically the same. Well, they're not built the same, but they're the same when it comes to volts and amp hours and what that means. And what the volts is, that's the power that the battery delivers. The amp hours is the runtime. When we're looking at a car like this, the volts in this case would be the size of the motor or the power, and the amp hours is the size of the fuel tank. So on these tools, they're delivering massive amounts of power, but they're not necessarily delivering massive amounts of runtime. So that means you're gonna have all the power you need, but you may be going back to the charger to keep the tool running for longer. Anyway, let's go see what Frankie and Sam are. Let's go back to Frankie and Sam. 24 volt, though. that's kind of wild. Small yeah. battery for a 24 volt, but. Well, yeah, they got yeah, two of them. They got the two amp hour and they got a four amp hour. Came with a nice case though. It's got wheels on it. All right, well, I guess I'm gonna try some of this stuff out as far as the two batteries will. Oh, wait, they're, these might have came. Have Hold on, oh, they might have these might have battery in them too. Yeah, these need a charge. That one does. So does that one. Oh. There's a battery. And there's a battery. Probably a battery in this one too. Yep. Now what's that? Another impact? This is a 24. Yeah. Oh. That's gonna be the driver. Yeah. That's oh, the big wow. boy there. There it is. Yeah, it feels about the same weight as the Milwaukee or the Makita one we got. Charges. Cool. What's that going to be? That's going to be a hammer drill. That's going to be no regular drill. So just a drill. Really? The drill and then your, your settings. Your torque settings. Yeah, just straight drill. That's cool though. I, yeah. I don't really. I've never ever hardly ever used them hammering drills as a regular you know, hammer. Yeah. No. I, I hear you. First impression on this stuff. Seems like it'll be all right. Yeah, so far, yeah. They all grip good. Yeah, they, they got a nice grip. They got the soft rubber that you, doesn't slip as easy, you know? It's yeah, hard, yeah. Well, let's do, we'll do a charge on these batteries and we'll do it as a test. Charge these suckers up and play around with them. Oh, and it's got a little, so you can hang it. And magnetic. Oh, it's my, nice. He 
stop. God, these are nice. They're pretty slick looking, huh? Dude, no, they just they they got a, a really good feel. No, I, right? I, I was impressed. Wow, I was expecting I was expecting junk. I was too, honestly. I was like, oh, I've never heard of these guys. Is Frankie getting the figuring on them? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, really? No, we're gonna. He'll come up with some cool. Crap. Yeah, we're gonna run them through their paces. One cool thing, the saw. It came with a guide. What? Yeah. I don't think I've got the other one. Okay, like a track saw guide. Mm -hmm. So this is cool. I like this hanger. Holy. Yeah. Crap. Look and it's that. mag yeah it's magnetic i wonder how strong that magnet is we had it stuck to the back of the splitter there pretty good but then yeah you can spin that dude that's sharp oh shnikes i like that where was this when I was a kid growing up? I was always stuck holding flashlight from my dad for like 20 minutes. And as soon as you moved? Wrong spot. Oh, dude, you got yelled at. Oh, you got yelled at. I know how that goes. Your dad do that to you, oh, too? Oh, God. He's, yep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, it built character, though. That's. What, I feel like that's almost like a rite of passage, though. You I know? that's gone. Yeah, I don't think people do that. Nobody, no. work, nobody works on cars anymore, man. How can they? They, they make them too technologically it's all plastic, advanced. They can't yeah. figure out what the hell. You open a hood, you don't got room for a wrench. Oh. <laughs> Holy. Wow. Wow. 24 volt, too. Wow. They're, they're. They mean, went all out. Dude, they mean business. Yeah. They probably got the, all the little nicks out of it, out of them. So they know now they work, what to put in. The other guys work the bugs out. So these guys just go, hey, this Come worked in. here, this worked there. Yeah put it together and this is what they get. All right, so this yeah. one has got three speeds on it. Yeah. Okay, I'm on one. Okay. All right, that's one. He buried her. Oh yeah, it did. Man, and that's a, what are we looking at, 10 inch? 10 inch lag. Yep. That's, that's <laughs> some <laughs> torque, man. Far to drain the, oh, just a notch. One notch, yeah. It's not too that's terrible, bad. I guess. No, I mean, that's a lot of work. Yeah, it was. Different speeds on this one here also. What does that say? Assist? I wonder what that does. There one, two. I mean, it just drops it. it oh, that's down. just. Yeah. And now here's that other button. The assist. Oh, when it, only when it needs the power. Oh. Yeah. Do you see that when that. it starts out? It's slow. Yeah. Okay, watch. I've never seen that mount of drill yet. No, that's that's kind of cool. Yeah, I mean, that way if you're putting in something where you don't need all the power, you don't don't take it. But once it starts needing it, there it is. Wow, that's kind of cool. I that like is that. cool. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that's really cool. Put the guide on. Kind of nice. So if you're making a long cut, throw it in there. It's straight, to, you know, without having to snap a line. And it comes with it. 
Usually you buy them, they're add-ons. Straight cut, 45. Don't even have to check nothing. Five yep. See a little bit rougher. Okay, now see this? Yep. It will go straight cut once. I still got it, but it doesn't bounce around it as much. It's a sloppier cut, but, but a faster cut. The orbital. The orbital is, yep. Straight cut? Straight. Oh, got the wrong blade in here, though. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, straight cut. Uh -huh. This is uh, orbital. It feels rougher. Right, it's yeah. a wider, yeah. And it, you can feel like it jumps around a little bit more. Okay, you push the blade out. And then that just changes out like how most of them, you know, yep. twist. Oh, that zipped right through there. Yeah, so the orbital is faster. On some materials, it'll leave it rougher. Yeah. So not all materials. What you think, Frankie? I liked it. I, I did. I only used it for a short period of time, but the quality seems good. The functions all work. Yeah, I think it's a good, so far, good tool. I mean, I wouldn't be afraid to go buy them and not be, and not be disgusted with what you bought when you got yeah, it home. Yeah, I hear you. Usually that's what happens. You go buy something and you get it home and it ain't what you expected, but these are, these actually are.